Praise the name of the Lord. God bless you all. As many of you that are connected to me, I pray that the Lord will touch you wherever you are connected from in Jesus' name. I decree and I declare that the power of Jehovah will begin to work in your life in the name of Jesus. I ask, oh Lord, Almighty, as many of you that are connected, wherever you are connected from, let the hand of God begin to move in your case in the name of Jesus. I pray for as many of you that are connected that the power of God will begin to work for you. Right there where you are in the name of Jesus Christ, I decree and I declare. As you are connected to this line, as you are almighty joining this line, I speak in the name of Jesus. Let the power of Jehovah begin to flow. Let the anointing of God begin to manifest. Let the power of God begin to flow into your life. In the name of Jesus, I decree into your destiny, into your life, that, oh God, my Father, by your miracle power, by your anointing power, In the name of Jesus, uh, receive the grace, uh, receive the power, receive the power, the power to move to the next level. Uh, receive that power in the name of Jesus. Uh, today being a day mighty, the Lord has made. Uh, the word of God says, the day is a day the Lord has made. Uh, we will be glad and will rejoice in it. Uh, I speak in the name of Jesus. Uh, that all my prayers for you today shall begin to bring answer, shall begin to manifest, uh, shall begin to bring testimonies. Uh, in the name of Jesus. As you are joining this program, I wanted to go ahead and begin to share the program, to begin to share the broadcast, because tonight our God is about to do something. Our God is about to do great and mighty things. Our God is about to do marvelous things in every life connected. In the name of Jesus Christ, I speak into your life. Let the miracle hand of God, let the hand of Jehovah begin to move for you, begin to work for you. Begin to work for you in the name of Jesus. Oh God of Elijah, arise in your power. Begin to manifest in the life of your children. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. As you are connecting, beloved, I want you to go ahead. Let me see you share this broadcast. As you're sharing the broadcast, the mighty hand of God is manifesting in every life. As many of you connected to me in the whole world, wherever you might be, I speak in the name of Jesus. Receive strength, receive power. As many that are weak, as many that are feeble, as many that have been already pulled down by one strange sickness or the other, I decree in the name of Jesus, receive strength right there where you are. Receive strength, receive the power of the living God in the name of Jesus. I pray for you that every infirmity, every sickness eh, that is upon your life, eh, receive strength, eh, receive the power, receive the healing eh, in the name of Jesus. I say receive strength, eh, receive strength eh, right there where you are. Let the healing power of God eh, begin to flow into your body, into your spirit, into your soul. Eh, in the name of Jesus, let the power of God begin to enter, begin to flow into your body, spirit, and soul. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. You are welcome to the prayer line. As many of you that are connected, you are welcome to today's prayer vigil. I pray for you one more time. I pray for you again in the name of Jesus. I decree into your life that every voice of darkness every voice of failure contrary to the will of god um, that is speaking against you i silence them in the name of jesus i silence them 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 in the mighty name of jesus and i begin to decree let the hand of god let the power of god let the anointing of god let the miracle hand of jehovah let it begin to rest upon everyone connected today. Today is your day of testimony. Today is your day of miracles. Today is your day of double testimony. In the name of Jesus, beloved, wherever you are, know that, yes, you are connected to the power of Jehovah. Know that the Lord God Almighty is here to touch you. Father, I speak to everyone today. As they are connected to me, as men that are watching, as men that can hear me, I decree that every bondage of darkness, 
over your life uh, is broken now. I break them. Uh, I break them. Uh, I break the bondages. The bondages of darkness. Uh, the bondages of darkness uh, over your life. Uh, be broken. 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 Uh, in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, you, that sister, listen to me carefully. Listen to me again now. I speak into your life. Uh, I decree into your life. Your two legs are weak. Your two legs are weak. I pray for those legs. Those two legs, I command them to receive strength. Those two legs, I command them to receive strength. I decree, let the strength of God enter into those legs. Let those legs receive strength. Let those legs receive strength. Let those legs receive strength. As many of you that are connected to me, I pray for you in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, let the healing power of God uh, begin to radiate uh, over your life uh, right now. In the name of Jesus, I decree to someone again, um, every arrow the enemy fired uh, into your life, uh, I decree let that arrow go back to sender. Go back to senders in the name of Jesus. Uh, as you are liking the video and sharing the broadcast, wherever you might be, let me be sure that you are sharing and you are almighty also liking this page beloved i'm praying for you right now the bible says but it was wounded for our transgression it was bruised for our iniquities the chastisement of our peace was upon him and with his stripes we are healed isaiah 53 verse 5 i say you are healed somebody listening to me now receive your healing and be healed be healed, be healed, receive your healing, divine healing, miraculous healing in the name of Jesus Christ. I say, receive your healing, receive your healing. The Bible says, He took our infirmities, He by our sicknesses, every infirmity, every sickness, I decree, let them dry up according to the word of God in Matthew 8, verse 17. He took all our infirmities. And a bear our sicknesses. Uh, Matthew 8 17. Uh, let it walk in your life. 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 Uh, in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, the Bible says, For this purpose, the Son of God was manifested that he might destroy the works of the devil. First uh, John chapter 3, verse 8. Uh, I decree that every works of the devil in your life uh, as well type amen uh, jesus christ uh, manifest your power jesus christ uh, manifest your power in the life of this your children as you are typing amen as you are sharing the broadcast uh, i say let the power of god uh, the son of the living god uh, let it begin to manifest uh, in that your domain in the name of jesus uh, i speak to every migraine uh, every headache uh, every pounding in the head uh, i command it to disappear 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 in the name of Jesus any power that is not of God that is warring against you from the crown of your head to the soles of your feet I decree in the name of Jesus let almighty those powers be buried now be buried now over your life I buried them I buried them in the name of Jesus every power walking contrary to the will of god from the crown of your head down to the soles of your feet i command those powers to be buried alive in the name of jesus to be buried alive in the name of jesus to be buried alive in the name of jesus to be buried alive in the name of jesus christ and i begin to decree that the lord god almighty the god that owns the whole world the god of the heavens and the earth i say i decree in the name of Jesus, every power holding you down, every power holding you down, physically and spiritually, I say, let there be a release. 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 Be released now. Be released now from the grip of the devil. Be released now from the grip of the enemy. Be released. Be released. Be released. Be released, be released, be released in the name of Jesus. As you are liking the video, sharing the broadcast, I say be released, be released now in Jesus' name. We pray. Amen. Listen to me carefully. 
The Bible told us about two blind men. Matthew 20, verse 30 to 33. Matthew 20, 30 to 30. It says, And behold, two blind men were sitting by the wayside. And when they heard that Jesus was passing by, they cried out, saying, Have mercy on us, O Lord, the son of David. And let me tell you one thing. The, the multitude told them that they should keep quiet. As many of you that will cry upon the Lord today, Jesus will have mercy on you. They told them to hold their peace. Even they cried the more, saying, have mercy on us, O Lord, thou son of David. And the Bible told us that Jesus Christ stood still and called them and said unto them, what will you want me to do unto you? They said unto him, let our eyes be open. The Bible told us that their eyes opened immediately. I want to pray for somebody listening to me. I want to pray for somebody that is hearing me right now. Right there where you are, you are calling upon the name of the Lord. Huh? I speak into your life huh? in the name that is above all names. Huh? Every spiritual blindness, huh? every physical blindness, huh? any bl where you are expressing blindness huh? in any area of your life, huh? I say right now in the name of Jesus Christ, huh? the Son of the living God, huh? I say receive your sight. Huh? Receive your sight, receive your deliverance. As you are liking the video, as you are sharing the video, as you are typing amen, I say receive your sight, 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 your spiritual sight. Let your eyes be open, 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 eyes be open. in the name of Jesus Christ we pray. As you are typing amen, as you are liking the video, as you are sharing the broadcast, I decree in the name of Jesus that every voice that is not of God, every voice from the kingdom of darkness, every voice from the covens of witches and wizards, every voice from the powers of your father's house and your mother's house that are speaking contrary to the will of God into your life. I stand here today. As a servant of God, I silence that voice. I cancel those voices. I silence those voices. I cancel them in your life, over your life. As you are typing amen, as you are sharing this broadcast, I cancel those voices. Every voice speaking contrary to the will of God against you, I cancel them. I cancel, I cancel, I cancel, I cancel, I cancel, I cancel, I cancel by fire. Ma poria caraba sandalikaya, repo scandalaba shake the boo, malika raba seke the I speak to you, that sister. Listen again to me carefully. This very weaker is your weaker. This is your weaker. I clearly will. That is covering your glory from shining. I command that umbrella to catch fire. To cut fire, 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 to cut fire. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pray for you, that sister, that particular problem on that chest, the one that is actually on the left breast. Father, in the name of Jesus, as you are watching, as you are saying amen, as you are listening to me, receive power. Let the power of God, the healing hand of God, enter into that breast now. Let the healing hand of God begin to flow into it. Let the power of God move. Receive healing. Whatever you have been diagnosed of, I'm decreeing right now by the authority in the name of Jesus. Be healed. Be healed. I say be healed. Be healed from the brain. Be healed from the chest. Be healed from the breast area. Be healed. Oh yes, on that breast. Be healed. I say be healed right now. Put your right hand upon it. Put your right hand upon it. Father, I decree in the name of Jesus. Every one of your children that you have revealed their situation right now, Lord Almighty, let your right hand, your hand, your healing hand, your hand of power, your hand of resurrection, let it rest upon that breast in the name of Jesus. So therefore, let every lump, anything that has been projected into that breast area, I decree right now, come out, 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 and dry up. In the name of Jesus Christ, I decree to somebody else right now, every voice that is not of God, that has actually hindered your progress, that has hindered your move, that has hindered your prosperity, that has hindered you from making progress, I silence that voice again. I am speaking to you, that brother. I silence that voice, the voice that is strictly contrary 
to the will of God for you. I silence the voice. I silence the voice. I silence them. I silence them. I silence them. I silence them. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Father, as you healed blind Bartimaeus, as you healed blind Bartimaeus, as many that are here with me, blind Bartimaeus was begging on the highway, according to Mark chapter 10, verse 46. Blind Bartimaeus was begging him. Father, I decree in the name of Jesus, as many that are here, they are sick, they are operating under one infirmity or the other, and they are also begging them by the decree of heaven, right there where you are, receive your healing. As Jesus answered and said unto Grand Batimosa, says, Come, and he said, What will you want me to do? He says, That I may receive my sight. Immediately, the Bible says, Jesus Christ. Thy faith had made thee whole. I speak to as many of you liking this video, sharing this broadcaster. Thy faith had made you whole. Your faith will make you whole. Your faith will make you whole. Receive your sight. Receive your sight. Receive your sight. Be healed. Complete healing. Complete healing. As blind Bartimaeus was healed, according to the word of God in Mark chapter 10, verse 46, I say, let the healing power of the Lord begin to flow into your body in the name of Jesus. Let the healing power of the Lord enter into your body in the name of Jesus Christ. Malika Rabba Sanda Kayaba. Le post candali kayaba shandali kayaba. Ma poli kayaba sandali kaya. As many of you that want the Lord to completely heal you, beloved, today is a day that the Lord has made. Today is the day that the Lord has made. I want to pray for some people. Le pushanda li karaba zikidi, mali karaba zandalaba. I want to pray on water for some people. If you have your water in front of you, get it now. For you, that sister, listen to me. Go get that water. Go get that water. Go get that water. Put it in a cup. Put it in a bottle. I want to pray to it now. I want to pray to it right now. As I'm going to be praying onto that water, as I'm going to be praying onto that water, it will begin to refresh you. It will begin to bring divine healing. It will begin to remove every demonic plantation. It will become a divine antibiotics. Listen, wherever you are, wherever you are right now, get a cup of water. Get a cup of water. Get a cup of water. And I'm going to speak into it. Beloved, the Bible says the hurt is the Lord and the fullness thereof. Wherever you might be, the Lord God Almighty, whom we serve, is the God of the whole universe. He knows no boundaries. As I'm going to be speaking today, just like I spoke yesterday, I spoke this before, and it began to happen. I want to say that you will have your own testimony. And so as you're getting that bottle of water, I begin to decree that it let your fire, let your blood, let your power enter into that water. As many that have the faith, as many that believe in Jesus Christ, as many that believe in your word and in your miracle, they believe that they are having complete healing right there as they have their water in front of them. Father, let your power begin to flow into that water. Let your anointing enter into that water. Let your blood flow into that water. Water, hear the word of the Lord. Go and get it. Go and get it. Sister, go and get it. Go and get it. Don't let your faith hinder you. Listen to me. You don't need much. Uh, the word of God came to Naaman, uh, the captain of the host of Syria, says, go and wash yourself in the water. Uh, the man of God did not even come to him. Uh, the man of God just said, go and wash yourself. Uh, the Bible says he was a leper. The Bible says by the time he washed himself, uh, he became, his skin became like a baby. He didn't even see the man of God face to face. Uh, they say, you are listening to me now. You are even seeing me face to face. Uh, somebody, you are here today. You are ready to be blessed. Uh, listen to me. No, body, no man can stop you. No woman can stop you. No one that is born of a woman can stop your blessing. Uh, and so I bring that blessing to you by the authority in the name of Jesus. Uh, I speak in the name that is above all names. Uh, Jesus Christ, uh, Son of the living God, uh, enter into that water. Uh, that they flow into that water. Let the power of God enter into that water. That water that you have the faith on in your hands. Le po karaba sakayaba. Le po skandalaba shanda kayaba. As many of you that are connected, as many of you that understand what I'm saying, you have your bottle of water in front of you. 
I say, let fire fall. Let fire fall into that water. Let fire fall into that water. I'm going to wait again for that brother. Malika Rabazanda Likayasha. Go and get the water. Go and get the water. Go and get it. Go and get it. Don't let your faith hinder you. Today you will see the hand of God. Today you will see the finger of Jehovah. Today you will see that God is a God that answers by fire. Even when you have not even been perfect, our God is ready to do great things. Right there where you are, I speak to that water. Father, let that water carry what I call unquenchable fire. Somebody let me be sure that yes, you can hear me and you have your water in front of you. Tell me, yes, pastor, I have my water. Let me be sure. Type it out. I, am, I will wait for you. I will wait because listen to me very well. Our God is a God that he, he, does, he knows no boundaries. He knows no boundaries. If your water is with you, let me be sure that yes, your water is with you. Let me see you type, yes, I have my water in front of me. Let me see you type, yes, I have the water in front of me. Le Listen to me, listen to me, every one of you. No matter how tiny the water is, the power of God will manifest. You will be shocked by the miracles that you are going to be getting. I'm waiting just for one more minute. And as I'm waiting, those of you that have gotten your water, let me see you begin to share the broadcast. Let me see you share the broadcast. Because Jesus is doing great things. The power of God is manifesting. The hand of Jehovah will move in your matter. In the name of Jesus. Yes, you got the water in front of you. My father, I begin to decree. As many of you that believe in you, they have the faith. They believe in your word. Just like Naaman believed. Just like blind Bartimaeus believed. Just like those two blind men believed. My father and my God. You are the God that holds the whole world. You are the God of heaven. You are the miracle walking God. You are the God that brought forth Lazarus from the dead. As many that are listening to me. As many that believe in your word. And they have their water in front of them. Father, I speak in the name of Jesus. Let your power, your miracle power, enter into that water. Enter that water. Let your power, your resurrection fire, your resurrection power, your resurrection fire, your resurrection power, let it flow into that water. That water, I decree in the name of Jesus. Your water in front of you is no longer under the water. It now becomes an anointed one. I ask God, let the angels of the living God that trouble the waters of Bethsaida, let them trouble the water. Let the angels of the living God that trouble the waters of Bethsaida, let them trouble your water. Let them trouble your water. Let them trouble that water for healing, for miracles, for signs, for wonders, for healing, for miracles, for signs, for wonders, for healing, for miracles, for signs, for wonders. Le pura bashanda kayaba. Father, I speak as your children have the faith, they're connected with me. My father, I ask for Lord, I release your blood. Let the blood just flow into that water. Let that water become divine antibiotics. Let it become a divine antibiotics. Let that water become a divine antibiotics. Everyone that comes in contact with that water, everyone that drinks that water, I say, let my, your healing, your healing power rest upon them let your healing power rest upon them every disease every mysterious sickness every mysterious infirmity that has troubled this your children as they drink that water let there be divine healing let there be divine healing let there be miraculous healing let your healing shock your doctors let your miraculous healing shock your doctors father you are the god of all flesh the word of God says, is there anything too hard for you? Jehovah, I decree by the decree of heaven, let your children, as many of them that have the faith, they have the faith, they have their water with them, receive life. Let your water receive life. Let your water receive life. Let that water receive life. Let the power of God, let the life in the blood of Jesus flow into that water, flow into your water. Flow into your water. Flow into your water. Let the life in the blood of Jesus enter your water. Enter your water. Enter your water. 
from the crown of your head to the soles of your feet. As you drink the water, you shall receive healing. I say you shall receive healing. You shall receive healing. A divine healing. You shall receive healing. Miraculous healing. You shall receive healing. A divine healing. In the name of Jesus. Let the power of God enter into that water. Let the miraculous hand of Jehovah flow into your water in the name of Jesus Christ. And so, Father, I decree and I declare that any power that is not of God um, touching any one of you, I say, when you drink that water, it will cast away the power of witches and wizards. When you drink that water, it will remove every deposit of darkness in your body. As you are drinking that water, it will begin to heal your blood. It will heal the water in your body. It will heal the veins. It will heal the flesh. It will heal every part of your stomach. In the name of Jesus, as you are drinking that water, as many of you that have been fed with what I call demonic food, I decree as you drink that water, the power of God in that water, will begin to evacuate uh, every sickness. Uh, it will evacuate uh, every deposit uh, of darkness uh, in the name of Jesus. Any evil growth in your body, as you are drinking that water, I speak in the name of Jesus. Um, let that growth dry up. Let the evil 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 growth uh, in your body. Let it begin to dry up. Begin to dry up. Begin to dry up. Begin to dry up. Let it begin to dry up in the name of Jesus Christ. I decree that the power of God, um, let the power of Jehovah trouble your water and convert your water to a demon crushing water. Let the power of Jehovah trouble your water, trouble that water and convert that water to a demon crushing water. In the name of you, I decree that let the divine antibiotics uh, and the divine vitamin, uh, let it begin to flow into your water. Divine antibiotics, uh, divine vitamin, divine antibiotics, divine vitamin, flow into your water. In the name of Jesus, every particle of your water, I command them to carry unquenchable fire, to carry unquenchable fire, to carry unquenchable fire, to carry unquenchable fire. In the name of Jesus, the fire that will disgrace every plantation of darkness. In the name of Jesus, let it disgrace every planting of plantation of darkness in your blood, in your veins, in your body. In the name of Jesus, Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God, let every particle of your water. Challenge every hidden poison in your life. In the mighty name of Jesus, as you will drink that water, I decree, let the power of the living water enter into it. As you will drink that water, let the spirit of wisdom, the spirit of knowledge, the spirit of understanding, let it begin to baptize you. In the name of Jesus, as you are drinking that water, beginning from today, the Lord shall open your eyes. As you are drinking that water, everything that is not of God in you, I command them to begin to be evacuated, be evacuated in the name of Jesus. As you are drinking that water, I decree that it will wash away every plantation of darkness in your life, in the name of Jesus Christ. And I decree that any power opposing that which God has done for you today, I say, let them be shifted away by that water. Let them be shifted away by that water in the name of Jesus. Any organ in your body that has refuse to walk right now let the power of god enter into the water and when the water connects that organ let that organ resurrect let that organ resurrect any organ in your body the kidney the liver whatever organ it is i command it to resurrect by fire 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 in the name of jesus and i decree that any power that is not of god that is opposing uh, that which God is do, going to do tonight. Uh, I command them to be chased out, uh, to be chased out, to be chased out of your life uh, in the name of Jesus Christ. My Father, I speak uh, that that water in your hands uh, will dismantle all the stubborn wickedness, uh, all the stubborn witchcraft uh, in your life uh, and in your environment. Uh, in the name of Jesus, I speak to you. Listen to me carefully. That every power that is not of God uh, waging war against you. As you drink that water, ah, I decree in the name of Jesus, every arrow fired into your body. As you are drinking that water, that arrow shall go back to sender, shall go back to sender, shall go back to sender, shall go back to sender. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray.
Amen. Let me shout. Let you shout fire seven times into that water. Fire. Open your mouth and shout it seven times into the water. Fire. Louder. Fire. Oh, yes. Fire. Louder. Fire. Oh, yes. Fire. Louder. Fire. Oh, yes. Fire. Louder. Fire. And I sanctify your water in the name of the Father. I sanctify your water in the name of the Son. I sanctify your water in the name of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus, I sanctify your water in the name of the Father. I sanctify your water in the name of the Son. I sanctify your water in the name of the Holy Ghost. I sanctify your water in the name of the Father. I sanctify your water in the name of the Son. I sanctify your water in the name of the Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. I want you to drink that water now as I'm praying. As, I, as you are drinking the water, Mapuri Karaba Sandalikaya, Marikaya Bashandalaba. If you need to go to the toilet, you could go to the toilet. If you need to vomit, you will vomit. If you need to throw up, just throw up. Le Karaba Sandali Karaba Zekedi, Mapuri Kayaba Shandali Kara, Zendekedibu Zandalaba Zekedibusha. Let the power of God begin to move upon the body of the waters of your children. Let the power of God begin to move. Let the power of God begin to move. Let the anointing of God begin to flow upon the body of that water. Let that water begin to transform your life. Let it begin to transform you. Open your mouth. You can drink the water now. You can drink the water now. Yes, you can drink the water. You can drink the water. Rest as you are drinking the water, the miracle hand of God is manifesting. The power of God is moving. The power of God is moving. The power of God is manifesting. Yes, from the crown of your head to the soles of your feet. From the crown of your head to the soles of your feet. From the crown of your head to the soles of your feet. Of your feet. Yes, receive light. Receive light. Let the light of God shine upon you. In the name of you, receive light. As many of you that are just connected, we just prayed on the water. As many of you that are just connected, we just prayed on the water. If you still have your water, the power of God is still moving. You can get as many as whatever type of bottle of water, but the power of God is manifesting today. Beloved, I can feel the power already. I can feel the power of God moving. I can feel the anointing of God moving. Yes, Lord, let the mighty miracle hand of Jehovah as many that have their water with them, I decree again, eh? let the mighty hand of Jehovah begin to flow into your water in the name of Jesus. I decree that in the name of Jesus, let your water be sanctified. I sanctify that water as you are drinking it, as it's entering into your body, as you are drinking the water, let it wipe away sorrow out of your life. Let that water wipe away every bitter water troubling your life let that water begin to enter into your system begin to destroy every plantation of the enemy as you have drank that water let it begin to enter into your system let it destroy every plantation of darkness let it begin to enter into your system let it begin to destroy every witchcraft plantation in the name of jesus christ and i declare that every power that is opposing the purpose of god for your life i command them to be silenced to be shifted away to be silenced to be shifted away by the power in that water in the name of jesus christ Father, I decree, I declare that your mighty miracle, let it begin to flow in the name of Jesus. I speak again, let this water scatter every charm that is working in your life. Let this water scatter every hidden darkness planted against you. Let the water you have drunk, let it begin to uproot every sickness out of your body. Let it begin to purge away every infirmity out of your life. Let it begin to purge away every sickness. The water you are drinking there, let it begin to melt away every sickness. The sickness that's on your data, every sickness that have defied medical diagnosis, every sickness that medical doctors don't understand. As you drank that water, I said, let it melt the sickness away. Let the sickness be melted. 
melted, be melted away, be melted away, be melted away in the name of any dead organ in your body. I command to come alive, to come alive, to come alive, to come alive, to come alive in the name as they are making contact with your water. Let that sickness come alive. Let that sickness come alive. Let that organ come alive and let that sickness die. Let that sickness die. Let the organ come alive. Let the organ in your body that has been dead come alive. Let the organ in your body that has been dead come alive as they are connecting that water in the name of Jesus. My father, I declare, let the water begin to dismantle all the stubborn witchcraftness, all the stubborn witchcraft power. All the stubborn which have agenda in your body, let that water dismantle them. Let the water dismantle them. Let the water dismantle them in the name of Jesus. My Lord, I say thank you, Lord. Oh, yes, Lord, we give you praise. Daddy, we say there is none like you. As your children have drunk the water, I say, oh Lord, one by one. Let your power, the power of testimony, let it begin to flow. Let the power of God begin to flow. Yes, that sister, listen, go and vomit. Go and vomit anything. Go and throw up. Go and throw them up. Anything you want to throw up, go and throw it up. Go and vomit them up. My poor Kayas. The power of God is moving. The power of God is, 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 is moving. I can feel the power. I can feel the power. It's moving right now. Someone, you are there now. The, the whole of your stomach is boiling hot. It's boiling hot. It's boiling hot. It's boiling hot. Yes, take it easy. Just sit down and make sure that, yes, the power of God is moving, is, is reconstructing them. Everything that the enemy has almighty is damaged in your body. Yes, the power of God is doing it right now. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, my poor Karabasanda Likaya. Shanda Likaya. My father, I say thank you because you are a glorious God. You are a wonderful Jehovah. You are the king of glory. I say thank you, Lord, for your daughter. Thank you, Jesus. Someone else again, put those water. Put some of them in your two eyes uh, because the Lord God Almighty is opening your eyes spiritually. Spiritually, now you your eyes will be open. Uh, you I don't know where you went to, you could not see. You could not, you can see now that you don't dream again. You don't have it, you don't remember your dreams. Uh, as you are putting those water, just put the eyes a little bit, just a little bit, because you have received the touch already. <laughs> you have received the touch of the living God. Uh, oh, I say thank you, Jesus. I say thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, King of Glory. Thank you, Lord. Say another person, I wanted to put those water a little bit in your ears, a little bit in your ears, because you begin to have the ear of Samuel. You will have the ear of Samuel now, because when Jesus called you now, when the Lord speak to you, you will hear one time. Just put a little bit drop. You used to hear also before, but you don't hear again. Just put a drop of the water into those ears. The two ears, just put it there. My Lord, I pray for somebody. Sprinkle a little bit on your head. On your head, beloved. Today is the day that the Lord has made. The day the Lord has ordained this day for you. Just put a little bit on your head, and I shall put it on your head. The fire of God is burning now. The fire, a hey, sister, you are falling on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> that is the part that can be the power of God. You are also falling on the floor. I'm not there. The power of God is the one that is there. I'm not the one making you to fall. You are falling on the floor by putting the water on your head. That's the start. Stand to your feet. Put it on your head a second time. The power of God is locating you. Any power that has pulled you down, any power ordained to destroy you. I decree in the name of Jesus, uh, let them be dismantled. Uh, let them be disgraced. Uh, let them be dismantled. Uh, let them be disgraced. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Somebody put that water on your head a second time. Put tiny again on your head. Uh, my Lord, by Lord, I decree that everyone here that is operating under what I call wicked power, they are operating under what I call wicked control, they are operating under what I call, under what I call occultic remote control, I command that be broken out of it. Let those powers release you in the name of Jesus. Be released, be released, be released, be released, be released, be released, be broken free, be set free for the word of God, but upon Mount Zion shall be deliverance and there shall be holiness and the house of jacob shall possess their possession right there where you are possess your possession 
in the name of Jesus. Possess your possession. Possess your possession. Possess your possession. Possess your possession. In the name of Jesus Christ. As many of you that are connected to me, let me see you go ahead and share this video. Yes, you that sister, put another one on your head the third time. Put it on your head the third time. The power of God is there. Ha, ha, ha. Le pushanda likaya, le skin de lebo shanda likayaba. As many of you that still have that water with you, listen to me very well. If you need to pray for your children with those water, I want you to do that. Don't let it finish. Don't let it finish. Malika raba zanda likaya. As many that are connected, just connected to me. Go get your water. Go get your water. The power of God is still here. The power of God is still with us. The power of God is here. I can feel the power. I can feel the power. I can feel the power. The divine hand of Jehovah is here. Marika Rabba Sandalaba. As many of you that have just connected and you never had the water, I want to pray for you right now. Just get that bottle of water. This is the second time I'm praying the prayer. Listen, if you did the first one, uh, you have a second touch right now. Father, in the name of Jesus, um, you are the king of glory. You are the Lord of all. You are the ancient of days. You are the mighty man in battle. You are the miracle walking God. Father, I speak miracles into every water that has been put before you, I say, let your miracle power, let your miracle hand enter into that water in the name of Jesus. Father, let your miracle power, the power of God that entered into the rod of Moses and it divided the Red Sea. Let that power enter that water. Everyone that is connected, everyone that can hear me, everyone connected in faith, as many of them that are put the water in front of them. Mapori Kayaba Shanda Likaya. Let your water begin to carry what I call unquenchable fire. Let it begin to carry miracles. Let it begin to fire, carry divine healing in the name of Jesus. Receive power. I speak to your water. Let your water receive life. Receive the anointing. Let your water receive life. Receive the anointing. Let your water receive life. Let it receive the anointing. In the name of Jesus, I pray for you one more time. That, that water you are carrying is no longer an ordinary water. It is now an anointed water in the name of Jesus. I say that water in your hands is an anointed water. It's an anointed water. It's no longer ordinary. It's not an anointed water. I say the water in your hands. It's not an anointed water in the name of Jesus Christ. And I say everything you have eaten up in your dreams, as you drink that water, it shall be flushed out. They 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 shall be flushed out. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, Lord. As many of you that are liking this video, let me see you share the video right now before I continue. The mighty hand of God is moving. The power of God is manifested. I pray for somebody again. As you're sharing the video broadcast and you're liking it, and you are also having your water with you, I decree in the name of Jesus that as you do that water, it will wash away the plantation of witches, uh, the plantation of darkness, uh, the plantation of fear uh, out of your life. Uh, in the name of Jesus, it will wash away every sickness, uh, every disease, uh, every infirmity. In the name of Jesus, uh, everything uh, that is not of God, uh, as you will almighty drink that water, I spill let the power of Jehovah, uh, let the resurrection power, resurrection fire, resurrection power. Resurrection fire, resurrection power, resurrection fire begin to flow into your water in the name of Jesus. And I decree that any power that is going to opposing the divine agenda of God for your life, every power opposing the divine agenda of God for your life, let the power of God dismount to them. Let the power of God in your water scatter them. Let the power of God in your water disgrace them. In the name of Jesus, right there where you are, I speak fire into that water. I speak the blood of Jesus into that water. I speak fire. I release the blood. I speak fire. I release the blood. I speak fire. I release the blood into your water. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. For those of you that have that water in front of you, let me shout. Let me see you shout fire of God. Enter my water seven times. Let's go. Fire of God. Enter my water. 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 
fire of God, enter my water. Fire of God, enter my water. Fire of God, enter my water. In the name of Jesus Christ, it is done. And as the fire has entered, I sanctify that water again. In the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, in the name of the Holy Ghost, I sanctify that water again. In the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, in the name of the Holy Ghost, I sanctify that water at all time. In the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, in the name of the Holy Ghost, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Somebody that water, go and put it on the head of your daughter now. Go and put it on the head of your daughter. Go and put it right now. Go and put a little bit on the head on that daughter, of that daughter of yours. La Poshandaba Zeke de Bosha. The arrow of insanity that has been projected against that girl. I command to go back to send her. To go back to send her. Your daughter will not go insane in the name of Jesus. The arrow of insanity that has been programmed into the life of that your daughter. I say your daughter will not go insane. Your daughter will not go insane. Go and put that water on the head right now. On the head of that your daughter right now. Lekashi karaba sakayaba. Mapoli kayaba sendekelebu shandali kaya. Let me see you go ahead and share this broadcast. I want to pray for all of you right now. Let me see you share the broadcast now. Let me see you go ahead and share this broadcast. Let me be sure that you're sharing here with me. Thank you, Jesus. For those of you that are connected, I know the Lord right there where you are. In the name of Jesus. Let me see you go ahead and share this broadcast quickly. Let me see you go ahead and share the broadcast. Let me see you go ahead and share this broadcast. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, King of Glory. Thank you, Lord of all. Yes, Lord. Ah, the power of God is manifested again. Mighty Father, I decree that as your children have drunk the water, let mighty let there be fresh idea, let there be knowledge, let there be wisdom, let there be understanding, let your let there be fresh idea. Beloved, I'm still praying for you. I have another prayer to pray for you. I'm still praying for you. I decree that the Spirit of God will flow into every life that drinks this water. The Spirit of the Lord, the anointing power of God will enter into every life in the name of Jesus Christ. Now, if you don't want that water to finish, just keep pouring more into the water. Just keep pouring more. The anointing power of God, just keep pouring more every time. Put the water somewhere and keep pouring more. And I will know that the Lord will do perfect. He will perfect that which he has started. In the name of Jesus. You, that sister, go back to your doctor. Go back to your doctor. Let them do another test. And you come and testify. Come and testify. Once you get that testimony, come and testify. Come and testify because the Lord has done it. The Lord has done it. The Lord has done it. I say it again. The Lord has done it. Let me see you go ahead and begin to share this broadcast. In the name of Jesus, I decree into the life of everyone connected to me that this very program, this very program, I speak by the decree of heaven. That every power that is not of God, every power on assignment to wage war against you, every power on assignment to wage war against your home, against your marriage, against your business, as you're sharing the broadcast, as you're typing amen, I command that power to be destroyed by fire, to be destroyed. Every power that is not wanting you to get any good thing in that land, every power that does not want you to be established in that land, I uproot them out of your life. I uproot them, 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 I uproot them. In the name of Jesus Christ, I uproot them now. Any power that want to attack you, any power that want to destroy you, any power that want to move against you, I uproot them now. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Praise the name of the Lord. For the benefit of those that are connected right now, let me quickly give you this wonderful information. That is some couple of people that are going on now on Facebook. They have created another account. And that account is with, is called Pastor Dr. Salako. It's not the pastor there is PST. Some of us here have just notified me today now. Some of us have just notified me today. Some of you have just notified me. What they're saying is that they have an orphanage somewhere in America and they wanted to donate some money. They wanted to donate some money via Western Union. 
they have the orphanage somewhere in New York. Listen and listen to me very well. If you want to donate anything, call us, speak to us. You know my page. And I pray that the Lord will touch you in Jesus' name. This page I'm talking about is Pastor Dr. Salakobo. The pastor written there is PST. P Dr. Salako. That is the way the page is. And so the page is fake. It's fake. This is the authentic one. And this is where you are meeting with us. And I know that the Lord will touch you as you are connected in Jesus' name. And if you have also seen such a request telling you to send money to an orphanage in New York in America, of course, that is untrue. That is false. I pray the Lord will continue to be with us in Jesus' name. So I want all of you to be as careful as you can. You've just, I mean, I've just had that now. Someone on this line have just given that to me. God bless us all. Father, I begin to decree in the name of Jesus uh, to your children, uh, as many of them that are connected. Uh, Father, any power that wants to waste you shall be wasted. Uh, every power on assignment uh, to waste you shall be wasted uh, in the name of Jesus. And I decree that any power that is not God uh, on assignment against your life, uh, wherever you are connected to me, as you are liking the video, sharing the video, typing amen, uh, I break those powers. Uh, I break them. I break their power. I break the power. The power of darkness over your life. I command them to be broken by fire. To be broken by thunder. To be broken by fire. To be broken by thunder. To be broken by fire. To be broken by thunder. To be broken. To be broken. In the name of Jesus. Every power that is saying that you will not amount to anything in that country. As many of you, you listen to me. You in Canada, listen to me. I speak in the name of Jesus. The authorities in Canada. They will have no choice but to answer you. They will have no choice but to answer you. They will have no choice but to answer you. So peace be still in the name of Jesus Christ. The hurt is the Lord and the fullness thereof. My father, I speak to that person in that Canada. I decree in the name of Jesus. Receive your settlement. Receive your settlement. Receive your settlement. I say receive your settlement in that country, wherever you might be in the whole world. I decree in the name of Jesus, every home officer, every official, every government office that needs to answer you. I am praying again for you that the way for you to be settled in that country, the way for you to be settled in that nation, let that power begin to rest upon you. In the name of Jesus, every application uh, that you have submitted, uh, I decree to receive divine answer as you are sharing this broadcast, uh, as you are liking and typing amen. Uh, I say receive almighty um, divine answer. Your application is approved. Uh, receive the approval. Uh, receive the approval. Uh, receive the approval. Uh, receive the approval. Uh, in the name of Jesus Christ, I say receive divine approval uh, for all the applications uh, that you have made. Uh, in the name of Jesus, receive approval uh, for those applications. In the name of Jesus, receive approval. Be yes, receive approval. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. And I begin to pray right now. I pray for you one more time. I pray for everyone connected to me one more time. That the power of God, the hand of God, the hand of Jehovah will be laid upon you. And immediately the Lord Almighty will heal you. I am praying for healing again, again, again. The Bible says in James chapter 5, verse 14, is any sick among you, let him call on the elders of the church and let them pray over him. Anoint him with oil in the name of the Lord. James chapter 5, verse 14, right there where you are, I pray for you. As a church, we are gathered together on this platform. And I pray for you in the name of Jesus. Let your healing come. Let your healing come. I say, let your healing come. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. By the reason of anointing, let every yoke be broken. Let every yoke be broken. Let every yoke over your life be broken. Receive complete healing. Receive divine healing. Receive the miraculous healing. In the name of Jesus. Be healed right there where you are. I say receive your healing. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. As the apostles went about, the Bible says they cast out devils, anointed people with oil, many that were sick, and they healed them. In the book of Mark chapter 6 verse 13, I decree today as an apostle of the Lord, as a servant of God, right there where you are, receive healing in your body. 
receive healing in your spirit receive healing in your soul in the name of jesus christ let the mighty hand of god let the power of god manifest and be begin to back up our prayers begin to back up our prayers today in the name of jesus the bible says on in all things whatsoever ye shall ask in prayer believing ye shall receive matthew 21 verse 22 as many of you that are listening to me and you believe you believe in the prayers of today i decree receive your healing receive your healing receive your healing divine healing miraculous healing in the name of jesus christ listen to me the bible told us and in those days the bible told us second chronicles chapter 32 verse 24 he told us that in those days ezekiah was sick unto death and he prayed unto the lord and he spake unto him and he gave him a sign ezekiah was sick unto death he was sick unto death second chronicles chapter 32 verse 24 second chronicles 32 verse 24 listen he was sick unto death the bible told us that he received healing i pray for you any one of you that the doctors have said that you will die by the reason that you are here by the reason of the anointing every yoke of death is broken forever i say the yoke of death is broken over your life the yoke of death i break it 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 i break that yoke of death over your life in the name of jesus let the yoke of death be broken by fire in the mighty name of jesus christ we pray amen let me see you like this video again let me see you share the video let me see you like and share the video i want to pray for some people for divine helper divine helpers ah, your divine helper the helper that needs to come and help you the helper that needs to come and remove you from that your dungeon ah, the one that needs to come and take you away from that place where you are i decree in the name of jesus ah, as the lord god almighty leave it ah, and the spirit leaves ah, i say let your helper locate you listen to me you that brother you that brother listen to me your helper will come and when your helper comes your helper will first give you an apartment huh? that is the first thing we will do that's a sign you will know the second thing is that your helper will bring a car for you you'll be saying is this true you'll be telling yourself is this true don't give up because god is on your side huh? because god is working miracles for you your helper will first give you an apartment it's not going to be a house it's going to be a flat it's going to be a flat listen to me carefully it's going to be an apartment after that your helper will bring a car again listen to me when those things come don't forget god don't forget god don't forget god i pray for somebody again that the helper that god even had ordained for you any power hindering them any power holding them bondage any power holding them from coming to you i command those powers to die in the name of jesus to release them and die to release your helpers and die Please help us and die in the name of, because your helpers must come to you. I decree your helpers will locate you before the end of this month. As many of you that are saying amen, as many of you that are sharing this broadcast, as many that are typing amen and liking this video, I decree that your helpers are your divine helper, the one that everyone has sent to you to help you. I speak in the name of Jesus, they shall locate you. In the name of Jesus, your helpers shall locate you. I say your helper shall locate you. I say your helper shall locate you. I say your helper shall locate you. Your helpers shall locate you. In the name of Jesus Christ, your helper shall locate you. In the name of every one of you, that your helpers can't find you because there's a garment of darkness on you, because there's a garment of reproach on you, because there's a garment that has been that has covered you. I speak into your life. Let that garment upon you, let that garment catch fire. The garment of darkness, the garment of the occult, the garment of witches and wizards that they've used to cover you, the veil of darkness upon your life. I command it to catch fire, 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 to catch fire. To catch fire. In the name of Jesus Christ, I say, let that garment catch fire. Let that garment catch fire. In the name of Jesus, because your helpers are locating you now. I said, your helpers are locating you. Put your right hand on your head. Your right hand on your head. And you shout loud and clear. Say, the crown of darkness upon my head. Catch fire. 
Open your mouth and pray to me. Crown of darkness on my head. Cut fire. Cut fire. Open your mouth. Command it to cut fire. The crown of darkness upon my head. Cut fire. Cut fire. Cut fire. Cut fire. In the name of Jesus Christ, the fire. And I decree into your life. I speak to your head. Every crown of darkness on that head. Let that crown begin to cut fire. We set a blaze. Any evil crown, any evil crown that is on your head, I command to cut fire. As you are typing amen, liking the video and sharing the video, I say, let that crown cut fire. Let the evil crown cut fire. 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 In the name of Jesus, every evil crown, demonic crown, every witchcraft crown on your head, I command you to cut fire. In the name of Jesus, cut fire. Cut fire, cut fire, in the name of Jesus, your crown, listen to me, your crown, your God-given crown that was stolen, I decree right now, I say let it be returned, be returned, be restored, be restored back to you, I decree let that crown of, your crown of glory that has been stolen by the witchcraft powers of your in-laws house, I say let that crown be restored, be restored, be restored, be restored by fire, be restored in Jesus' name, be restored. The crown of glory that has been stolen from your head. Let the crown be restored in the name of Jesus. Let that crown be restored. Let that crown be restored. Let that crown be restored. I decree again, let the crown of your glory that has been stolen by witches and wizards be restored by fire. Be restored now. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. I pray for somebody again. Yes, thank you, Jesus. Mm. The open door, that good door that God has opened for you, that door of divine opportunity that God has opened for you, and the enemy is about to close it listen to me listen to me you those there's 17 of you there's 17 of you i speak in the name of jesus any power that want to challenge that door every prince and princess of Persia that want to challenge that door that want to challenge that door i say let them run mad in the name of jesus let them run mad any man any woman born of a woman Anyone that is under the sun that want to block your divine opportunity, that want to block that door, that good door that God has opened unto you, I say, let them run mad in the name of Jesus. I command them to run mad in the name of Jesus. And I speak within the next seven days, every power that has to die for that door to open. Beloved, we're not here to joke. We're not here to joke. We are not here to joke. The man of God, Elijah, had to call fire down. He had to call fire down upon those 50 soldiers. He had to call down fire. I want to decree right now that the fire of the God of Elijah, let it fall upon every stubborn enemy that does not want you to enter into your testimony. As many that does not want you to enter into your, into, into your breakthrough. As many that want to shut the good door that God has opened for you. I say, let the fire of the God of Elijah begin to smite them, begin to scatter them, begin to destroy them in the name of Jesus. Let that fire of the God of Elijah begin to smite them, begin to scatter them in the name of Jesus. Begin to put them to flight. Sister, listen to me very well. The, the shop that you're going to, the shop that you're going to, and it looks like you're not selling anything there. It looks like you're not selling anything there. Go back there. Speak the word of God. Speak the word of God. And you'll begin to sell again. You'll begin to sell again. Beginning from now. Beginning from right now. Beginning from now. Not tomorrow. Beginning from right now. When you go back into that shop, I would like you to lay your hands on the four corners of the shop and speak into that shop. Saying, shop, hear the word of the Lord. Begin to sell. Begin to become profitable. Begin to become profitable sister did you hear what i said you know yourself you know yourself if you are there let me tell let me be sure that you can hear me tell me yes pastor i can hear what you have said 
Let me be sure that you can hear what I have said. Let me be sure that you are not sleeping. You know yourself very well. The shop has not sold anything. The shop sells nothing. It has not been selling. And you are bothered. I want to go back there now. I want to do what? Go back there right now. Thank you, Jesus, for that, sister. Thank you. I can see your comment already. The Lord has identified you. I know that the Lord will do great things in your life in the name of Jesus. Glory be to God. I pray again for someone that every power that is not of God, every power that is not of God, every power that is not of God, that is waging war against you, the ones that are waging war against you, I silence them. I silence them. I silence them. I silence them. I silence their power. I silence them. I silence their power. I silence their power over your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I know that you are a God that does not sleep. You are a God that does not slumber. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Someone, you have a wound on your head. Sister, you have a wound on your head. Oh, Malika Raba Zanda Kayaba. You have a wound on your head. Malika Raba Sanda Lika Raba Shende Kedibuza. The wound on your head is receiving a touch of God. The wound on your head is receiving the divine touch. It's receiving a divine touch. So right there where you are, I want to pray for you. I don't want to, let me stop because of you. I want to pray for you right now. But that wound on your head, I say let it receive a touch of the power of God. Receive a touch of the power of the living God. That wound on your head, that wound on the around the back of your head, you know yourself very well. That wound is receiving a touch. That wound is receiving a touch. That wound is receiving a touch. A touch of his power. 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 Ya pori kayaba sanda li kayaba. Yes, that's the sister. You, I mean, I, I mean, that the Lord has revealed it to you already. Yes, I know. I know you are there. The Lord has revealed it. I decree into your life uh, that the wound on that back of the head, uh, la li kayaba shanda laba. Daddy, you are the master healer. I lift my hand to Lord Almighty and I pray for your daughter. I decree in the name of Jesus, let that wound be completely healed uh, right now. Be completely healed. Let that wound be completely healed. Let there be complete healing. Complete healing. Complete healing. Divine healing. Complete healing. Unto her. Oh, yes. As many that have one wound, whether it's a tiny wound, whether it has become a big one, Lord, let your healing power touch them. Let your healing power touch them. Jesus, you are God. You are a must. You are the revealer of secrets. You are, the, you are the one that can open and no one can close. You are the one that closes and no one can open. By the authority in the name of Jesus, I speak into those wounds to receive healing, divine healing in the name of Jesus. Let there be complete and total healing in the name of Jesus Christ we pray. Amen. I pray for another sister. You are always having good dreams. You are always having good dreams, but you've never seen those dreams come to pass. You've never seen any of them come to pass. I want to pray for you now that every power that is attacking your dreams, every power that is attacking your dreams, as they could not attack Joseph's dream, as they could not hinder Joseph's dream, as they could not obstruct Joseph's dream, I speak that your dreams are that you have had the good ones that you've had, uh, I command them to begin to come to pass, uh, to begin to manifest. Uh, I speak again uh, that those good dreams, uh, I say, let them begin to manifest. Uh, good dreams, uh, let them begin to manifest. Uh, let it begin to manifest. Uh, those your good dreams, uh, I say, let it begin to manifest uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I say, let good dreams in your life uh, begin to manifest now, begin to manifest. Uh, and yes, yes, begin to experience the power of God. Begin to experience the power of God. Begin to experience the power of God in the name of Jesus Christ. My Lord, I say thank you for your children. Yes, Lord Almighty, I thank you for your mighty power over their lives in the name of Jesus Christ. Everybody stretch your hands towards me now. If you're carrying your phone with you, I don't know how you're going to do it. Just stretch your hands towards me. Lali kayaba shandalaba. Zekidibus karaba likaraba likayaba shandalikaya. I pray for as many that are stretching their hands towards you, O oh Lord. I ask, O oh Lord, that you will touch them. 
Daddy, touch every hand, uh, every hand that is almighty lifted right now. Daddy, touch them. Daddy, touch them. Daddy, touch them. Daddy, touch them. Let there be a divine torture. A divine torture. Receive a divine torture. Right there where you are, receive a divine torture. As you are receiving that torture, every wicked hand uh, that has been programmed into your hands, uh, I challenge those hands uh, to be cut off. Every demonic hands uh, inside your hands, uh, I command those hands uh, to be destroyed. Every demonic hands uh, that has been programmed into your hands, uh, I command them to wither. Anything that has been programmed into your hands uh, and you have never made profit, uh, as, you are, as I'm praying right now, let those hands begin to make profit. Let those hands begin to make profit. Let those hands begin to make profit. If you have never really worked or you are looking for a job, right there where you are, let the power of God, the power to multiply, the power to profit, the power for breakthrough, let it fall upon your hands, upon your two hands as you're stretching it. Let the mighty miracle hand begin to locate your hands, begin to fall upon your hands. Let your hands magnetize money. Let your hands magnetize money. Let your hands magnetize money. Let the anointing to magnetize money fall upon those hands. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Now, let me go ahead. Let me see. Go ahead and share this broadcast again. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. I want to pray for somebody again. As you're sharing this broadcast, as you're sharing the broadcast and typing amen, liking the video. As you're sharing this broadcast, typing amen, liking the video. I pray for promotion. For somebody, everyone that has sat on your promotion, every power that has sitting on your point your promotion, I unseat them because your promotion is now. It is time for you to be promoted. It is time for you to be promoted. I say it is time for you to be promoted in the name of Jesus. It is time for you to be promoted. It is time for your promotion to come. It is time for you to be promoted. It is time for your promotion to come in the name of Jesus. Receive your promotion. In the name of Jesus, receive your promotion. Every power, every witchcraft gang up, every satanic network that are saying that you will not be promoted, I scatter them. I scatter them. I scatter them. I scatter them. In the name of Jesus, I scatter them. In the name of Jesus, I scatter. I scatter. I scatter them. As you are liking this video, as you are typing amen, as you are sharing the broadcast, let me see you share the broadcast to all your groups. To all your groups. Share the broadcast to all your groups. I decree in the name of Jesus. Every witchcraft power, every occultic power, every demonic power that is going to hindering your promotion, I command them to scatter, to scatter, to scatter. By fire to scatter in Jesus' name, to scatter, to scatter, to scatter. I am praying for you, my sister and my brother. I am praying for you. I say, let them scatter wherever they are gathered, whether at your office, whether at your home, in your village, in your father's house, in your mother's house, in your environment. I command them to scatter because your promotion is now in the name of Jesus. Your promotion is now. You are moving to the next level. You are moving to the next level. Any power sitting upon you and they're saying that you will not get anything i unseat them now i unseat them now i unseat them i unseat them i unseat them in the name of as you are typing amen as you are liking and sharing the broadcast listen to me carefully listen we are here we are actually prophetically we are moving in the prophetic and we are acting as we are acting the mighty hand of god is manifested let me tell you as you are sharing the broadcast the power of God is moving into your life. I have prayed that everyone that shares the broadcast, there is no way you will have testimony. And as you are sharing the broadcast, the power of God begin to manifest in every area of your life. Those hands that you're using to share the broadcast, I speak to those hands as you are taking action, as you are doing exactly what I wanted to do. The Lord begin to touch your hands and your hands begin to make money. Let your hands begin to make money. Let promotion begin to fall upon those hands. Let promotion begin to fall upon those hands. Let money meet money in those hands. In the name of Jesus, every one of you that are asking for a profitable employment as we are sharing the broadcast. Receive that profitable employment. Receive a profitable employment. A profitable employment. As you are liking the video, as you are typing amen, receive a profitable employment. In the name of Jesus, let there be what I call doors of business opportunity. Doors of breakthrough begin to open unto you. Doors that have never opened before. In that country where you are, let good doors open. Let good 
doors open uh, as you are liking uh, and sharing the video and sharing the broadcast uh, as you are typing in uh, let good doors open my sister i am praying for you now whether you understand or not i'm praying for you i declare let good doors open Open for you. Let good doors open. Let good doors open. Great doors open. Great doors open. That door that the Lord has opened in that country, and you are yet to enter. I push you into it now. Enter. Enter into your opportunities. Enter into breakthrough. I push you as you are saying amen, as you are sharing the broadcast, as you are typing amen, as you are believing in what I'm telling you. I say enter into that broad, into that mental breakthrough. Enter. Into that testimony, enter there, enter, enter, enter in the name of Jesus Christ. The business breakthrough you need in that country, I say, receive it now, receive it now. The divine idea you need, I say, receive that idea in the name of Jesus. I say, the divine idea you need, receive the power to get it, receive the power. Receive the anointing in the name of Jesus. Beginning from today, you shall begin to multiply. There shall be no loss. There shall be no loss. You shall begin to multiply. As you are typing amen, as you are sharing the broadcast, as you are almighty liking it, I say you shall begin to multiply. Multiplication shall be your lot. You shall begin to multiply. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. My Father, I speak to everyone connected to me. Whether you understand it or not, I decree into your life. Where you are failed, beginning from right now, I say beginning from this moment, I say you shall be successful. You shall be successful. Where you are failed, everywhere you are failed, every department of your life, where you are failed, I say beginning from today, you shall be successful. Success shall be your lot. I say success shall be your lot. As you are saying amen, as you are typing amen, as you are liking the broadcast, as you are sharing it also, I say you shall be successful. I'm decreeing into your life. I'm speaking into your life. Listen to me very well. Job 22, 28 says, Thou shalt decree a thing, and it shall be established unto thee, and the light of God shall shine upon your ways. I am decreeing into your life that the light of God shall shine upon you, that the power of God shall move into your life. In the name of Jesus, where you are failed, hear me and hear me well. Where you are failed, you shall be successful there. You shall be successful there. Success shall be your portion in the name of Jesus. Oh, heavens, arise and push this your children to the next level. Oh, heavens, arise and push them to their next level. Oh, heavens, arise and help them, push them to their next level in the name of Jesus. I pray for that brother again. The people that needs to help you, they did not help you, but the word of God has come right now. They are changing their mind. The word of God says they are the heart of men is in his hands. He turned it where he wanted. The Lord is turning their hearts now. They said no before. Now they will help you. When they help you, well, let us hear your testimony. In fact, let me hear your testimony clean and clear. Because help has come. Help has come. Heaven will help you. Men will help you. Women will help you. White will help you. Black will help you. Brown will help you. Yellow will help you. No matter the race, uh, I say they will help you in the name of Jesus. So right the way you are, receive help, uh, receive divine help, uh, receive divine help, uh, receive divine help, uh, receive divine help. As many of you that are tapping into that anointing, that are tapping into that prophecy, I say receive your own help in the name of Jesus. Receive help, uh, receive help, uh, divine help, uh, receive help, uh, divine help, uh, receive help, uh, receive help. Let your helpers locate you. In the name of Jesus Christ, and I decree that all the power of oppression over your life, I break them into pieces. In the name of Jesus, every witchcraft oppression, every demonic oppression, every occultic oppression, I say, let it be broken over your life, be broken to pieces, be broken by fire. You shall not be oppressed, thou shall not be oppressed, you shall be far from oppression. I say, thou shalt be far from oppression. Oppressions of the night, oppressions of the day, I command it to be broken away in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I say, thank you, Lord. I pray for Almighty, as many of you that are connected again to me, that the Lord will heal your loved ones. 
I pray for somebody you are crying, oh, if God will heal my loved ones, my Lord, I am praying for that person right now, that those members of your family that they're asking for divine healing for, I join my faith with you right now, in the name of Jesus, the King of glory, the master healer, let the healing power of God begin to locate them now, begin to locate them now, begin to locate them, begin to locate them, begin to locate them, begin to locate them now, in the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. For the benefit of those that are just connected again, let me quickly give you this simple and straight information. I've, there's another, there's a Facebook page called Pastor Dr. Salako, which has been identified as fake. They are requesting for money from you for an orphanage in New York, in America. Listen to me carefully. If it's not me, it's not me. If it's not myself or my wife, it's not us. So the page is also the same name, but the pastor has been spelled as P S T Dotson Salako. That's the way they spell the pastor there. They've used my same picture. Okay. Make sure that you don't fall for them because it is fake. Okay. When they ask you for anything, don't listen to them. If it's not us talking to you here, my wife and I, if we don't want talking to you, those are fake. Please make sure that you are beware. They're going to be using the same name. Uh, I've reported them also, and they've been. We, we, we've, uh, we've tried to make sure that uh, they. I mean, they're not. But make sure that you're aware. May, some of us on this platform have told me. Some of us have told me. Make sure that you're aware. Remember that when things are getting good, of course, there's going to be a lot of people that want to. Uh, uh, they will want to come and mess us up, isn't it? When people like things are getting good, listen to me. I want to tell you that it does not matter who wants to bring you down. It does not matter how they want to bring you down. It does not matter the plans and the programs they want to use and bring you down. I decree, everyone shall bring them down. Listen, sister, everyone shall bring them down. Everyone shall bring them down. My brother, open your mouth and open your mouth and say this with me. Say, every stubborn power assigned to bring me down. Oh, heavens, bring them down. In the name of Jesus, every stubborn power assigned to bring me down. Oh, heaven, bring them down. In the name of Jesus, oh, heaven, bring them down. Bring them down. Bring them down. Bring them down. In the name of Jesus, oh, heavens, bring them down. In the name of Jesus, I say, oh, heavens, bring them down. In Jesus' mighty name, they are brought down. I want to pray for you again before we leave. Listen to me very well. I want to understand that. That the Bible says, you shall not die but live to declare the works of the Lord in the land of the living. Every power and assignment to kill you, every arrow of untimely death, every dream of death that you have been having, every dream of communicating with your dead uncle, your dead auntie, your dead brother or sister, or your dead father or mother that you have been having, every dream of the mortuary, every dream of the graveyard, as you are on this line with me, I cancel that dream. In the name of Jesus, I cancel the dreams. Every demonic dream, every occultic dream, every witchcraft dream, negative dream, I cancel them by the power in the blood of Jesus. I cancel any dream that you have been having. Make it a liking and share the broadcast. As you are sharing the broadcast, every demonic dream, every dream that is not of God, that is coming your way, I cancel them by the blood of Jesus. I cancel them in the name of Jesus. I cancel. I cancel demonic dreams, satanic dreams, occultic dreams. I cancel them in Jesus' name. I cancel them. I cancel them. I cancel them. Every dream that is not God, I cancel them in the name of Jesus. I cancel every witchcraft dream, every occultic dream, every demonic dream. I cancel them in the name of Jesus Christ. I decree every dream of spirit, husband, spirit, wife, every dream of marine kingdom. I cancel that dream. I nullify it. I cancel it. I nullify it. And I decree that spirit husband, spirit wife, releases your children by fire. Release them. Release them. Release them. Release them. Release them. Release them by fire. In the name of Jesus Christ, I decree you, the spirit husband, you, the spirit wife, 
troubling these ones i say enough is enough let them go release them by fire release them by fire release them by fire release them by fire spirit husband spirit wife release these your children in jesus name we pray amen praise the name of the lord let me see you like the video share the video we want to pray seven prayers now these seven prayers will usher us to the final of this prayer and I know that the Lord will answer your prayers, my prayers in Jesus' name. You will take the first one loud and clear. Are we ready? Seven prayers before we leave. Seven of them. Seven of them. You will pray the first one with fire and with thunder in your voice. Are we ready now? You will shout with fire and with thunder. Say, every occult power walking against me. Die in the name of you. Every occult power walking against my life. Open your mouth and begin to pray now. Command them to die. Every occult power walking against me. I command you to die in the name of Jesus. Die by fire in the name of Jesus. Every occult power walking against my life. I command you to die. Open your mouth and pray the prayer for yourself. You are praying for yourself now. Every occult power walking against my life. I command you to die in the name of Jesus. Every occult power. Walking against me, I command you to die in the name of Jesus. Die now, die now. Open your mouth and pray the prayer. Every occult power walking against my life, I command you to die in the name of Jesus. To die, to die, to die, to die in the name of Jesus Christ. Every occult power walking against my life, I command you to die in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth, command them to die. Occult powers. Walking against me, I command you to die in the name of Jesus. I command you to die. I command you to die. I command you to die. Every occult power walking against my life, I decree your obituary. Die in the name of Jesus. Every occult power walking against me, I command you to die. I command you to die. I command you to die. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. That was prayer number one. That was prayer number one. Beloved, we are still praying. This is a prayer. Is a prayer session. Is a prayer. Session. We are still praying. We have seven of them to pray. Are we ready? Are we ready? Let me pray for somebody before we go into prayer number two. Father, I pray for somebody that is listening to me right now. I pray <coughs> for your citizenship. I pray for your residence in that country. I ask, O oh Lord, let it be handed unto you in the name of Jesus. It shall be easy. I can see it. Uh, that approval of that residency, I say, is handed unto you now. It's handed unto you. I am praying for you now. Before we pray, pray number two, I speak in the name of Jesus. Your residency, that paper you need in that country, that your approval, approval to work, approval to stay in that country. I say, receive it. It is easy. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. As you are typing, amen. Liking the video, sharing the video. I say receive it, receive it. It is handed on to you. I say it is handed. The approval is handed on to you. I'm not, I'm not joking here. I'm not joking. I'm telling you, it is handed on to you in the name of Jesus. Yes, receive the approval. Receive the approval. Receive the approval. Receive the approval in the name of Jesus Christ. My Father, I say thank you. I bless your name. I give you praise in the name of Jesus. Let me give you a testimony before we pray number two. Two days ago, I told, I told you. A sister, we said, you're going to get a house. She spoke to me and said, Pastor, the house has been given to me. Listen to me carefully. Our God does great and mighty things. And when the Lord reveals, he says it and he does it. Our God does not fail. Man can fail. Man can fail. God does not fail. I want to pray for you again. That the document you need in that country, the document you need for you to be settled, that official approval you need, uh, receive it now. 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 As you are liking, sharing the video, Almighty, and typing Amen. Uh, receive it now. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Number two prayer. Let's go. Say every umbrella of darkness operating uh, in my heavens. Catch fire in the name of jesus every umbrella of darkness operating in my heavens i command you to catch fire now 
Cut fire now. Cut fire. Cut fire. Cut fire. Open your mouth. Umbrellas of darkness operating in my heavens. Catch fire. Catch fire. Open your mouth and pray the prayer. Pray the prayer with me. Umbrellas of darkness operating in my heavens. Open your mouth. Move around and pray the prayer. Command you to catch fire. In the name of Jesus, every umbrella of darkness operating in my heavens. Catch fire. In the name of Jesus, catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Umbrellas of darkness operating in my heavens. I command them to catch fire. Somebody pray the prayer. Every umbrella of darkness operating in my heavens. Cut fire now. Cut fire now. Cut fire now. Open your mouth. Command them to cut fire. Cut fire now. Cut fire now. Cut fire now. Cut fire now. In Jesus' name, they're on fire. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. That was our prayer number two. Let me see you share this broadcast. As I pray for you, as I'm going to be praying for you now, I want your amen to be dynamic. As I'm going to be praying for you now, let great things, uh, let good things uh, begin to happen in your life immediately. As I'm going to be praying for you, Father, I pray for your children. Uh, I decree into their lives. Uh, oh Lord, I ask, oh Lord, that everything that is not of God, uh, that the enemy has put against them, uh, everything that is not of God, uh, that the enemy has made it put against you, I command you to clear off. Uh, to clear off, to clear away, to clear away, to clear away. In the name of Jesus, I pray for your family that the Lord Almighty will divinely protect your family. I decree and I declare, he that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. Psalm 91 verse 1, I speak protection for your children, for your children's children, for your grandchildren, for your in-laws. I speak protection. None of them shall be in the wrong place. None of them shall be in the wrong place. I decree the fire of God will they will protect your children's children in the name of Jesus Christ. It will protect your entire family in Jesus' name. We we'll pray. Amen. Prayer number three. Are we ready now? Prayer number three. Are we ready? Thank you, Jesus. Let me be sure that yes, you are ready. Thank you, Lord. Prayer number three. You will cry loud and clear. You will shout this with fire and with thunder in your voice. Say, altars of witchcraft. Holding my name and my picture, catch fire in the name of Jesus. Altars of witchcraft, holding my name and my picture, catch fire in the name of Jesus. Altars of witchcraft, holding my name and my picture, catch fire in the name of Jesus. Altars of witchcraft, holding my name and my picture, catch fire in the name of Jesus. Altars of witchcraft, holding my name and my pictures, catch fire. Cut fire, cut fire, cut fire, cut fire. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. We have just prayed number three prayer. Thank you, Jesus. I want to pray for somebody again. I want to declare to your life uh, that the Lord will fight for you and you shall hold your peace. Every battle that you're going to right now in your father and your mother's house, every battle you're going to right now in your village, Every battle you are going to right now in your family, I say the Lord will fight for you. I pray for somebody now as you are shouting amen, as you are typing the amen, as you are sharing the broadcast, as you are liking the page, I decree the Lord will fight your battles. The Lord will fight your battles. Every battle that is confronting you now, as you are typing amen, I say the Lord will fight for you. The Lord will fight for you. The Lord will fight for you. You shall hold your peace. The Lord will fight for you. You shall hold your peace. The Lord will fight your battles. In the name of you, I say the Lord will fight your battles. He will fight for you. The Lord will fight for you. The Lord will fight for you. In the name of you, the Lord will fight for you. In the name of you, everywhere you are, one by one, right there. The Lord will fight your battles. He will fight for you. He will fight your battles. He will fight for you. And you shall hold your peace. In the name of Jesus Christ. And I decree the Lord will show himself to you. He will show himself to you. He will reveal himself to you. I want to say it again. The Lord will show himself to you. He will reveal himself. He will show himself. He will reveal himself. He will show himself. He will reveal himself. He will show himself. He will reveal himself. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Now you will not cry loud and clear. The next prayer you want to pray, you want God Almighty to arise for your sake. You want God to arise for your sake. So this prayer number three now. What 
What number are we now? What prayer are we now? Is it number three or number four? What prayer are we now? Tell me. Let me be sure you are following me. What prayer are we now? Thank you, Jesus. What prayer number are we now? I want to pray for you right now. I want us to pray together. Now. What prayer are we now? Thank you, Lord. What prayer? Prayer number four or the prayer number three? Are we ready? Are we ready now? Thank you, Jesus. So we're on prayer number four. We're on prayer number four. Thank you. For those of you that are connecting and that, 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 that are following, very good. I can see that you're all following. Prayer number four. Are we ready now? You want to cry with fire. You want to cry with thunder. You will shout as loud and clear. Say every arrow of backwardness fired into my destiny. Backfire in the name of Jesus. Every arrow of backwardness fired into my destiny. Backfire in the name of Jesus. You are praying now. Let's open our mouth and pray number four prayer. Arrows of backwardness fired into my destiny. I command them to backfire. In the name of Jesus, to backfire, to backfire, to backfire, to backfire, to backfire, to backfire. Arrows of backwardness fired into my destiny. Backfire now. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth. Are you praying with me? Arrows of backwardness backfire, 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 backfire. In the name of Jesus, arrows of backwardness fire into my life. I command you to backfire. To backfire, to backfire, to backfire, to backfire, to backfire, to backfire, to backfire. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Before we go into prayer number five, six, and seven, I pray for you one more time. I decree into your life. Beloved, as I'm praying for you, be sharing the bridge, share the broadcast. As I'm praying for you, type amen. As I'm praying for you, I want you to go ahead. And like this page, like the page, like the page, like the page. My Father, I speak in the name of Jesus. Everyone that is connected to me, everyone that is listening to me, everyone that can hear me, I ask the Almighty, let the heavenly surgeon perform the necessary surgical operation in their lives. As many of them that need Almighty operation, oh heavenly surgeon, begin to perform the necessary surgical operation in the life of these your children in the name of Jesus as many that have been doing operation and they are saying you should come back again I am praying for you right now the heavenly surgeon let them begin to perform the necessary surgical operation the necessary surgical operation in your life in the name of Jesus I say let them begin to perform it let them remove what needs to be removed now let them begin to plant what needs to be planted now let them begin to perform that necessary surgical operation in your body. In the name of Jesus, I decree right now, everything that the doctors have failed at, I ask for the heavenly surgeon to begin to carry out the necessary surgical operation in your life. In the name of Jesus, let them carry it out. Let them carry it out. I say, let them begin to carry it out. In the name of Jesus Christ, I speak from the crown of your head, to the soul of your feet, receive divine healing, receive a divine touch, receive divine healing, receive a divine touch, receive divine healing, receive a divine touch, receive divine healing, receive a divine touch. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. The Bible says, James chapter 5, verse 15 and 16, it says, And the prayer of the faith shall save the sick, and the Lord shall raise him up. I am praying for you with the faith I have. James chapter 5, verse 15 and 16. James chapter 5, verse 15 and 16. And the prayer of the faith shall save the sick, and the Lord shall raise him up. And if he had committed any sin, they shall be forgiven him. I pray for you right now, whether it is your sin of your father's house or your mother's house, as I'm praying for you in faith. Let the prayers of today begin to deliver and save you in the name of Jesus. And the Lord shall raise you up. I say the Lord shall raise you up. Sister, the Lord shall raise you up. That right, that left leg, I say the Lord shall raise you up. Receive a touch of the power of God. Receive a touch of his healing in that leg. Receive a touch. Receive a touch of the power of Jehovah in that leg. Receive a touch. Receive a touch. A divine touch. Receive a touch on that leg. Receive a touch in the name of Jesus Christ. We pray. Amen.
Thank you, Jesus. We will go into our prayer number five. Are we ready now? Are we ready? Beloved, we need to go into our prayer number five. Are we ready? Because I know that God will do great things. Huh? And as he's doing great things, he will do marvelous things for everyone connected. Wherever you're connected from, prayer number five. We we'll pray prayer number five loud and clear. You will shout this with fire. You will shout with thunder in your voice. Huh? You will say evil patterns of darkness huh? in my life. Scatter in the name of Jesus. Prayer number five, evil patterns of darkness in my life. Scatter in the name of Jesus. Evil patterns of darkness in my life. Scatter now. Scatter by fire. Scatter now. Scatter by fire. Open your mouth and pray prayer. Evil patterns of darkness in my life. Scatter by fire in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth. Are you praying? Pray along with me. Evil patterns of darkness in my life scatter now. Scatter now in the name of Jesus. Evil patterns of darkness in my life scatter by fire. Scatter now. Scatter by fire. Scatter now. Scatter now. I command them to scatter. Evil patterns of darkness in my life scatter now. Scatter by fire. Scatter by fire. Scatter. 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 Scatter by fire. In Jesus' name, they are scattered. Amen. I'm praying for you now. We have two more prayers to pray, but let me pray for you again. Father, I pray for your children. I decree and I declare, as many that are looking unto you, that when will they marry? When am I going to get married? I say right now that your marriage will manifest. I say your marriage will manifest. Your wedding bell will ring. I decree that your spouse, the man, the woman that God has ordained for you, that spouse that the Lord has ordained for you, they shall locate you. 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 The God given spouse, the one that is God fearing, that heavenly spouse, that heaven had designed for you, just like Eve was designed for Adam. I speak in the name of Jesus. You will not miss him. You will not miss her. You will not miss him. You will not miss her. You will not miss your spouse. I say the heavenly spouse, the one that God has given to you for marriage. For marriage, I say you will not miss her. You will not miss him. In the name of Jesus, your marriage will manifest. I say your marriage will manifest. I pray for all the singles that are listening to me right now. In the name that is above all names, Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. I say, let your marriage manifest. Huh? 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 Any veil of darkness huh? that is covering your eyes huh? and is not allowing women to see you or men to see you or even that your heavenly spouse to see you. I say, let the veil of darkness catch fire. Catch fire. Let that veil catch fire. As you are liking this video, as you are typing amen, as you are sharing the broadcast, huh? let me see you share the broadcast as you are sharing it. Huh? I say, let those veils catch fire. Let the veil catch fire. Evil veil. I command you to catch fire in your life. To cut fire. 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 fire. In the name of you. And I say, your wedding bell will ring. I say, your wedding bell will ring. As many of you that have a spirit husband and spirit wife, and they are not wanting you to get wedded. They are hindering you from your marriage. I decree in the name of Jesus, spirit wife. Let you go. I say, let the spirit wife, the spirit husband, trouble your life. I command them to catch fire, to be destroyed. Every spirit wife, every spirit husband, troubling your earthly marriage, troubling you for marrying. I command them to be separated from you. Sister, listen, to be separated. My brother, they, they be separated. Spirit wife must let you go. Spirit husband must let you go. Let the fire of God separate you. Fire of God separate everyone listening to me. Fire of God separate you now. Fire of God separate you. 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 Let the fire of God separate you from spirit husband and spirit wife. In the name of Jesus Christ, every power hindering your heavenly marriage, every power that is not allowing you, that does not want you to get married, I command them to be buried alive, to be buried forever. As you are liking the broadcast. As well, oh my say, liking the broadcast and sharing the broadcast. I say, let them be buried alive. As we're sharing the broadcast, let those powers be buried alive in the name of Jesus. And I decree that the hand of God will move in your matter. 
I say the hand of God will begin to move in your fears. The power of God will begin to work for you. In the name of Jesus. Father, I ask God that you will do great and mighty things. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. My sister, get yourself ready. Your wedding bell will ring. Whether the devil likes it or not, your wedding bell will ring. I've said it and so it shall be. In the name of Jesus. Amen. We will pray. We have two more prayer points. We are number six now. Am I correct? We are number six, isn't it? We are number six. We are number six. Let somebody correct me if I'm wrong. We are number six. God bless you. We are number six. You will cry with fire. You will cry with thunder. You will cry with an enough is enough spirit. My brother, my sister, I know the Lord will touch every one of you. You will shout this loud and clear. Say, idols of my father's house are signed to disgrace me. Catch fire in the name of Jesus. That's prayer number six. Idols of my father's house on assignment to disgrace me. Catch fire. In the name of Jesus, every idol of my father's house on assignment to disgrace me, cut fire. In the name of Jesus, every idol of my father's house on assignment to disgrace me, cut fire. In the name of Jesus, every idol of my father's house on assignment to disgrace me, cut fire. Cut fire. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and pray the prayer. Idols of my father's house on assignment to disgrace me, cut fire. Cut fire. Catch fire, catch fire in the name of Jesus. Catch fire, catch fire, catch fire, catch fire. Say it loud and clear. High doors of my father's house on assignment to disgrace me. I command you to catch fire, catch fire, catch fire in Jesus' name. They're on fire. Amen. Now we're going to pray the seventh prayer point. Thank you, Jesus. The hand of God is moving upon you as I'm going to be praying for you right now. Listen to me carefully. I pray for every one of you that are connected to me. Wherever you are connected from, I decree into your life uh, that the great deliverer, the king of glory, he will fight your battle in the name of Jesus. Uh, you, that sister, listen to me. Hey, that trouble that is happening in your marriage right now, peace be still. Peace be still. Peace be still. I decree in the name of Jesus, uh, every arrow of fire to scatter your marriage. I command the evil out to go back to sender in the name of Jesus. To go back to sender in the name of Jesus. To go back to sender. To go back to sender. To go back to sender in the name of Jesus Christ. I say, let the peace of God, ah, that surpasses all things, let it fall flow into your marriage. Let it flow into your marriage. Let there be peace. Let there be peace. Let there be peace. Let there be peace in the name of Jesus Christ. And I declare that this very month, without might see anything your blessings will manifest the manifestation of the blessing of god will flow into your life throughout this month in the name of jesus receive the power receive the anointing to receive the blessings as we are liking this broadcast as we're sharing the broadcast let the power of god begin to flow into your life into your home in the name of jesus let it begin to flow now let it begin to flow into every area of your life in the name of jesus i say let the power of god begin to manifest in the name of jesus christ yes lord i say thank you lord and i pray for somebody that everything that is for you right now the depth that you are facing right now you are facing financial situation the lord almighty is touching every area of your finances the lord is touching every area of your finances yes as many of you that know what i call debt cancellation the power of god is canceling it in the name of jesus as you are liking the video, share the video. I decree in the name of Jesus. Let the Lord lift you high financially. Let the Lord lift you high. Let the power of God lift you high. Declare that you, the miracle hand of God, will begin to manifest into your life, into your body, into your spirit, into your soul. Let the miracle hand of Jehovah begin to baptize everyone in the name of Jesus. As men that are connected to me, whatever the enemy has planted in your life, I decree, let it be removed, let it be uprooted, let it be uprooted, in the name of Jesus, let the fire of the living God begin to manifest in every home, in every life, in every child, in every boy, in every girl's life, in the name of Jesus, I decree again into your life, that every arrow the enemy fired at you, I command the arrow to go back, 
to send her to go back 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 to send her in the name of Jesus every dream of backwardness every dream of death every dream of retrogression I cancel by the power in the blood of Jesus I cancel them I cancel I cancel I cancel I cancel in Jesus name I cancel in Jesus name I cancel them now in the name of you and I begin to decree that every altar that is holding anyone in prison in the prison of darkness I say let that altar release you now oh yes release them every altar holding you down every prison holding you down let there be released be released now be released be released now be released be released now be released now in the name of Jesus the release and so father I say thank you Lord for as many that connected with me I say glory be unto you Lord Jehovah we exalt you King of glory we adore you Nima. in the name of Jesus let's pray the seven prayer loud and clear are we ready to pray number seven prayer this is a final prayer for this day number seven prayer let me see you share the broadcast like the broadcast let others that are not those that are lost the connection let them be let them begin to get the connection again we want to pray number seven prayer now are we ready now let us pray the seven prayer with fire and with thunder let us pray the seven prayer with fire and with thunder are you ready you will shout this loud and clear say every strange power tormenting and troubling my life die in the name of jesus every strange power tormenting and troubling my life I command you to die by fire in the name of Jesus. Every strange power tormenting me, troubling my life. I command you to die by fire. To die, to die, to die, to die. Every strange power tormenting my life, troubling my life. I command you to die. Open your mouth. This is prayer number seven. Open your mouth. Pray the prayer. Every strange power tormenting my life, troubling my life. Die now. Die now. Die. I command you to die in the name of Jesus. Every strange power tormenting my life, troubling my life. Die by fire. Die now. Die by fire. In the I command them to die. Every strange power. Every strange power troubling my life, tormenting my life. Die. 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 In the name of Jesus. Every strange power tormenting my life. Troubling my life, die by fire in the name of Jesus. Every strange power tormenting my life, troubling my life. I command it to die, to die by fire, to die, to die, to die in Jesus' mighty name. We pray, amen. And so, Father, I pray for your children one by one. I decree and I declare that as many that are looking for their stay in the land, I decree that you get it in Jesus' name. The permission for the leave to remain, the permission for your residency. I'm praying again for you that it is settled in the name of Jesus. I say the home office, the almighty authorities, they will make a law that will favor you, that will favor you, that will favor you in the name of Jesus. Let me be seeing you share the broadcast and share like the like the page as you are sharing the broadcast and liking the page and typing amen. I am praying for you that your marriage must must flourish. It will not die. Your marriage will not scatter. Your marriage will flourish. Any evil leg that has entered into your marriage, I command those legs to work out because the Lord Almighty will begin to bless your marriage beginning from today. My spouse will locate you in the name of Jesus. There will be a divine connection. And this is your year, Almighty, of marriage. Your marriage and your wedding bell shall ring this year. We shall, Almighty, celebrate with you. In the name of Jesus, the Lord shall give you a God-fearing spouse as a life partner. The Lord will give you a God-fearing spouse as a life partner. As many men, as many women connected to me, the Lord will give you a God-fearing spouse as a life partner. In the name of Jesus Christ. And I pray, Almighty, for those mighty that are having trouble again in their marriage, the Lord will repair the foundation of your marriage. The Lord will repair the foundation of your marriage. In the name of Jesus, I pray for those that are looking for the fruit of the womb. The Lord Almighty will grant you the fruit of the womb. The Lord will grant you the fruit of the womb. The Lord will grant you the fruit of the womb. There will be healing in the body. 
healing in the spirit, healing in the soul, healing in the womb, in the name of Jesus. There will be divine healing in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray for as men that are looking unto the Lord for a divine employment, a profitable employment, you shall get a profitable employment. As you are liking this video, as you are typing, amen, get a good job in the name of Jesus. Get a good job, get a good job, get a good job. Get a good job in the name of Jesus. I pray for as many of our students, the spirit of knowledge, wisdom, understanding, it shall baptize your life. It shall baptize you. Spirit of knowledge, wisdom, and understanding. Let it begin to baptize you. Let it begin to baptize you. Let it begin to baptize you in the name of Jesus. I pray for career breakthrough, for marital breakthrough, for business breakthrough, for spiritual breakthrough, for even for almighty ministerial breakthrough. As many men of God that are connected to me, listening to me, I decree ministerial breakthrough for you. Ministerial breakthrough for you in the name of Jesus Christ. And I begin to ask that the hand of God begin to deliver you from every ancestral foundational power. For every generational bondage, the Lord begin to deliver you from the bondages of darkness. In the name of Jesus, receive deliverance from every ancestral power. From every foundational power, from every generational power, every generational battle, every generational bondage, receive deliverance from any bondage, every bondage of your father, your mother's house, every bondage in your environment. I say receive deliverance from every generational bondage, every foundational bondage, every territorial bondage, every ancestral bondage, receive deliverance from them. In the name of Jesus, I pray for you again. That the almighty family idol that is holding everybody down. I say receive deliverance from that family idol in the name of Jesus. Every evil pattern in the family, I command that evil pattern to scatter, to scatter evil pattern in your family. As you are liking this video, as you are typing amen, as you are sharing it, I say let the evil pattern in your family scatter. I scatter them. I scatter them in the mighty name of Jesus. And I pray for all your children, everyone that is connected to me. I decree that your children shall not die, but they shall live to declare the works of the Lord in the land of the living. I decree promotion for all your children. I decree increase for all your children. I decree divine health for your children. I decree mighty that every stubborn pursuer assigned against your children shall be paralyzed, shall be paralyzed, shall be paralyzed. In the name of Jesus, every spirit of untimely death, pursuing any of your children, I command that spirit to die in the name of Jesus. And I decree that your children shall be the head and not the tail. I say they shall be the head and not the tail. Your children shall be born again. Even at an early stage, they will know Jesus. They will know Christ in the name of Jesus. And I speak all around promotion for everyone connected to me. All around promotion. Promotion spiritual promotion physically you shall know jesus the more every day of your life the word of god will grow in you the word of god will grow in you your prayer life will become better i say your prayer life will become better your prayer life will become better your bible story will become better in the name of jesus you will almighty read the word of god you will study the word of god you will also pray more you will get closer to the lord every day of your life in the name of Jesus. And I speak uh, that everywhere you've been thinking God will arise. I say God will arise. Let God arise and let all your enemies be scattered. Let all your enemies be disgraced. Let your, all your enemies go into hiding. Let them be put to flight. The Lord will arise for you. Your enemies shall scatter. The Lord will arise for you. Your enemies shall scatter. The Lord will arise for you. Your enemies shall scatter. The Lord will arise for you. Your enemies shall scatter. In the name of Jesus, and I speak to someone, every evil growth in your body, I command it to dry up. In the name of Jesus, evil growth in your body. You can't tell anybody. Evil growth in private areas of your body. I command it to dry up now. To dry up now. To dry up by fire. To dry up now. Evil growth in any area of your body. I command it to dry up. 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 Every demonic movement in any part. Of the body, I command that movement uh, to disappear. Whatever is there to come out by fire in the name of Jesus Christ. My Father, we thank you. Jehovah, we exalt you. King of glory, we adore your name. We say thank you, Jesus, for everyone connected to me. 
We exalt your name. We say thank you, Father Lord. I soak everyone with the blood of Jesus. And I decree that it is well with you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost. I cover you all with the blood of Jesus. I cover your family, your home, your property, your going out, your company with the blood of Jesus. And I decree that it is well with you in Jesus' name. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Praise the name of the Lord. God bless you all. Like I told many of you that I connected earlier on before the connection broke off, I there's a page that is titled the same as my page called Pastor Dr. Salakon, but the pastor has been spelled as P-S-T. P-S-T Dr. Salakon. That is the way the page has been spelled. The page has been asking for money to be sent via Western Union to an orphanage in New York City in America. It is fake. It is fake. It's not me. Some of you have also asked me. Some of you have connect, contacted me. It is fake. So please, if it's not me, it's not me. And if it's not my wife, it's not, it's not us. Okay? And the Lord will bless you all in Jesus' name. So God bless you. Continue to strengthen you all in Jesus' name. I know that there's a new thing that will be happening in your life in the name of Jesus. God bless you all. For those of you that are yet to join the page called 100 Million Souls for Christ, go join that group. It's a group. 100 Million Souls for Christ is a group. Go and join it. And Women Pray. Go and join those two groups. Women Pray, 100 Million Souls for Christ. And we will contact you. We'll begin to I mean, put some prayers there. And I pray the Lord will touch every one of you in Jesus' name. For those that have been blessing us, the Lord will bless you in Jesus' name. For those that have been saying, the pastor, I want to bless you all. Oh, I say the Lord will also bless you for the fact that you're remembering all. The Lord will remember you in the name of Jesus. So God bless you. The Lord will increase you, will multiply you, will multiply your family, will multiply the works of your hand in the name of Jesus. Have a wonderful time and stay blessed. Let me see you go ahead again one more time and share this broadcast. For those of you that are connecting, share this. for those that have just arrived, the Lord will be with you in Jesus' name. God bless you all. God bless you all. So the prayers continue. We'll see you again in Jesus' name. Have a wonderful time and stay blessed. Let me see you share the broadcast. Let me see you share the broadcast for those of you that are connected with me. Let me see you share the broadcast. Thank you, Jesus. God bless you all. God bless you all. All right, have a lovely time and stay blessed, okay? If you're here to share the video, please share it. Go ahead and share it. 